there is some masculine energy let me actually turn this music down my husband got this sports plan so loud I'm trying to use this background music to cover it up okay so what I'm getting there is a masculine energy that is trying to make you feel like you're you're so obsessed with him or something like that he is feeling like real emotional and stuff over you he's feeling like he's losing his patience over you he's i'm hearing a hypocrite this masculine is a hypocrite okay so what he's been doing what he's been doing he is like infatuated with you he's infatuated with you he's got some kind of feelings for you he's got emotions for you he he's a hypocrite he's been showing he's been showing you like um one side of him or something like that but behind closed doors or maybe you know of another side of him but behind closed doors this this masculine is attacking you spiritually behind the scenes and you know about it he's been actively doing uh some black magic over you behind the scenes but he presents himself to you another way possibly in the material world in the 3d right now he's trying to do some kind of magic to make you think you're obsessed with him it's like obsess over me still yeah this is a narcissist this this man could be at a distance or maybe you're distant you could be physically or emotionally distant with this person with this man this masculine energy he is very full of himself. He's a narcissist. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Like one way he tries to present him like present himself like he's this good guy and stuff, but he's actually not. He's got a lot of negative energy. He's always doing um, spiritual attacks over you. Some of you guys, he's doing spiritual attacks over you and someone else. He could be doing spiritual attacks over um, you and uh, another love interest, you and a romantic partner or your soulmate or something. Yes. So this is clarity for some of you guys. He's a narcissist. If you was wondering if he was a narcissist, yes, he is. What you're sensing, what you may be possibly sensing is accurate yes you're not crazy you're not imagining that it's not in your head this masculine is is literally very very angry impatient yelling and screaming spiritually attacking you and possibly someone else maybe some of you guys is what i'm sensing He doesn't know what to do with his life. God's telling me he does not know what to do with his life. Some of you guys, he's thinking right now about um, quitting his job or something like that. Or giving up on his life. Yes, you can't make it up. Crying, spiritual text, thinking of you. Yeah. He's crying. Crying is here twice. Crying, crying, depressed, nostalgic, missing you, pain and sorrow. This masculine is thinking of you and then he's getting so mad he's doing spiritual attacks over you because he's hurt. So he wants you to be hurt. Yeah, he's got, okay, that's why. He's got a love-hate relationship with you. Love-hate. One minute he, he loves you maybe or likes you or whatever. Infatuated with you. He's got these uh, passionate feelings for you. And then the next minute, he's he's got a lot of hatred, full of hate, and then spiritually attacking you. 
yeah, look at this man on this card screaming. This is definitely a man or a masculine. Controversy, drama, scandal, truth coming out. This is the truth coming out about who he really is. He's a hypocrite. He's like a smiling liar. This is someone that he's not, he's not who you think he is or other people think he is. He's thinking about quitting his job is what I keep getting. Spiritual attack, karma, divine intervention, facing their demons. He's demonic. He is demonic, but he tries to act like... Um, he does demonic low vibrational stuff, but he tries to act like he's, he's, he doesn't. He tries to act like he's um, the opposite of that, but he's not. It's just a facade. It's just this, this person's very deceptive, very... This person's a liar. This person's always lying. This is a pathological liar. Some of you guys, this is a masculine, like, he's always trying to... He's always doing dark stuff over people or over you, maybe, spiritual attacks magic and stuff spell work but he's always trying to play victim like like someone's doing something to him he some of you guys he's trying to look at you like you're doing spiritual attacks or something like that over him like he's placing false blame on you this is a narcissist this is a narcissist that refuses to look themselves in the mirror this person is very very toxic and dangerous soulmate reverse this is not your soulmate this is not your soulmate okay some of you guys soulmate reverse and give your relationship a chance wedding work on your partnership some of you guys this situation involves a marriage a serious relationship or some kind of partnership some of you guys you guys are working on another relationship or involved in another relationship. This masculine is not your soulmate. The one I just told you about. Maybe that's why he's doing this. Some of you guys, yeah, it's over you and your person. He's doing spiritual attacks over He's obsessed with you. He's thinking about quitting his job and he's like, he don't know what to do with his life or something like that. He's experiencing bad luck. You don't care. Care reverse. <laughs> you don't care. That's what I'm getting. You don't care. You possibly don't care about this, this masculine or have feelings for this person. He's dealing with misfortune and stuff. He could be broke, losing money, or he's not going to be receiving some kind of, there's a big check here on this card. He is thinking about quitting his job. He's thinking about how he's not going to be receiving like checks anymore or something like that. Some of you guys, there could be a family involved or something with kids involved. There's a couple here and a baby. Some of you guys could have could have been at a park recently, went to the park recently or something like that, or 
Some of you guys could have took your kids to the park recently. Yeah, Will of Fortune reverse. Oh, Eight of Swords. Yeah, you're guarded towards him and stuff. Nine of Wands. He's trying to cross your boundaries or something. Or he's crossing your boundaries, something like that. He's feeling very uh, like weak and stuff and scared, insecure. He knows that this actually came out sideways. <clears throat> Excuse me. He knows that something really bad is getting ready to happen to him and he's scared. He's all in his head, trapped in his head, feeling stuck, feeling scared. He's trying to act like he's a victim. This is a masculine that's constantly been spiritually attacking you, possibly you and someone else. But he's trying to act like he's he got some kind he could have some kind of uh, mental issues. Um, he's trying to act like you're doing something to him or something, or he's a victim to something like that. He's getting very bad karma for doing this kind of stuff to you and others. His any type of money he had or fortune or luck or good opportunities he had is being taken away like immediately. He knows it's only a matter of time where something very, very bad is about to happen. Could be a Sagittarius, Pisces, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo. This is an enemy. This is an enemy that he is really trying to make you think you're obsessed with him. Yeah, this is, he's on some weirdo stuff. He's obsessed with a queen of pentacles. He's obsessed with a feminine. He's trying to make a feminine energy feel like she's obsessed with him. This person could be jealous of you. This masculine could be jealous of you or something like that. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. He's caught. He's going down. Yeah, he's thinking about quitting his job. Eight of Pentacles, reverse. Seven of Swords, reverse. Seven of Wands, reverse. Yeah. Seven of Wands, reverse. Eight of Pentacles, reverse. That's somebody thinking about quitting their job. Giving up on themselves. Quitting. He's lacking confidence. He could feel like hiding or something. He's feeling overwhelmed, full of... The self-doubt keeps increasing more and more and more for him. This is his karma. But what he's trying to do right now, he's trying to present himself as if he's not going through karma. As if he's not going through misfortune and bad luck. He knows the cycle is completely over for him. This is a negative phase. The wheel is turning in a very, very negative way. Some of you guys, this masculine, he is getting ready to, he's in spiritual jail right now. But some of you guys, in, in real life, he is about to be like in jail, like actual jail. Yeah. He got caught doing some kind of magic over you or something spiritual tax possibly at a distance he's thinking of you hurting and thinking about quitting his job some truth came out truth coming out Yeah, he's trying to hide to he's trying to hide the people that he's going through bad karma. Like he's trying to um he's trying to deceive people. He's trying to like he just wants people thinking he's not going through misfortune. Like he's lying to people and stuff like that. There's a king and king of pentacles involved. Two of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, this masculine is feeling overwhelmed or something. 
Yeah, he's doing this over two or more people. He's doing this over you and someone else. Two pentacles reverse. Yeah, he's feeling off balance and stuff. He's his mind is very off balance. His money's off balance. His schedule's off balance. He's feeling disorganized. There's, there's this reckless energy here. He's frustrated. Some of you guys, he's doing this over a feminine and a masculine. Could be doing this over you and your divine masculine. Yeah, some of you guys are getting ready to get married. You're getting ready to get married to someone else that he's doing this to. There's about to be a wedding or something or like a four of wands energy. Yeah, he's this person is weird. Seven of cups. This person is stuck in some kind of delusion or something like that. Could be delusional. He, yeah, he's delusional. He thinks you're obsessed with him or something like that. Five of Wands. Yeah, there's a lot of conflict, drama. Could be competing. He keeps blaming you or something like that. Yeah, yep. Judgment reversed. He's the only one doing spiritual attacks because that's why he's getting karma. He's doing spiritual attacks over people. Judgment reverse. Yeah. Yeah. His life is being rip ripped to shreds. Like everything is just falling apart right now for this masculine energy. Yeah, fatality. He could have a fatal attraction to you or something like that. Yeah, look, prison and court. This person is in spiritual jail right now. Some situation in his life is ending or being laid to rest. Some of you guys, someone could have passed away. He could have been involved in something like that. That could be why this person could be going to prison for some of you guys. Wow, court. Yeah, this is karma, justice, the justice skills. He could be wrapped up in something with court, something legal. Either way, this is his karma. Some kind of huge karma is here for this person, for this masculine energy. Spiritual jail, yeah. God says he's in spiritual jail. Work, achievement, success reversed. Yeah, he's about to quit his job or something like that or lose his job or his money, his checks. Tank card. Celebration, fun, enjoyment. You have good luck. You have great good fortune. Four leaf clover. Bull. He could be trying to bully you or something. Could be a Taurus. Do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. Yeah, he keeps trying to come up against you. And the five of wands. He could be trying to come up against you and somebody else. Somebody could be going to jail for fighting or something. Leaked text messages. It could be some leaked text messages, leaked information. Someone's on the edge of their seat. Yeah, he's nervous. Excuse me. Angry. This person is, this man is angry. Wow. This could be something about an email. Soulmates. He is angry over you and a soulmate. He's trying to act like he's got this thing in his mind where he thinks you guys are soulmates.
there, there could have been like a fight at work or something like that or an argument at work or something. There's something happening that's causing him to lose his job or quit his job or something like that. Held back by limiting beliefs. This person's been thinking about you. Yeah, I've been thinking about you. Yeah, care reverse. You don't care. Like, you don't care. You about, Some of y'all don't even know this person. This could be someone. Someone is unhealthy. Father. This could be a father involved. Father. Wow. I'm hearing something like he blew it. Opportunity. Could be an opportunity or, or an opportunist. He blew an opportunity. He blew an opportunity, something dealing with his job or something with his luck. He blew a good opportunity. Yeah, this is someone they are. He He's trying to act like he's a good person. He had a good opportunity and blew it. It's something related to the spiritual tax or he's, stuff he does to people behind the scenes. Somebody's feeling very vulnerable. Your beauty moves them. He's like real, he's, he's like real nervous and shaken up about something. I have better things to do than to F with you right now. And something about single. Okay. He could be single. You are doing the most. You got better things to do than to be effing with him. Yeah. You don't care. Care reversed. Some of you guys, he cried last night when no one was around top of the deck. He could be crying because he's losing an opportunity. This could be someone that messed up their reputation. Shows more why this person is angry. Grudge holder. Creeping. He's doing some kind of magic over you. Could be candle magic. Grudge holder creeping. He's holding a grudge for something. Hustling reversed. Focused on making money reversed. He don't, he's not focused on getting money. Yeah, it's something with his job with Eight of Pentacles. Reverse, Seven of Wands reverse. I feel like this person's thinking about um, quitting their job or something like that. Some of you guys, by the time you see this, this person did quit their job or they're getting released from their job. Yeah, this this person's crying and stuff. He's crying over something with his job. He, yeah, he, he had a good job or something or something like that and he's losing it. I don't know why he's spiritually attacking you guys. So. It's because your happiness, he's a karmic. Karmic happiness. Yeah, there's a total ending or transformation. Karma is here. Pluto, karma, and drastic. Could be a Leo, Scorpio, karma, balance, justice. Maybe you guys are going to court, taking him to court or something, or involved with something with court with him, or justice. Prison, drastic, extreme, harsh cutoff. He's doing way too much. Some of you guys are getting a rest you have a restraining order over this man or you're getting one or maybe you need to you possibly need to it's something involving your guys's relationship he's crying he's literally crying over your guys relationship or over you moon and cancer this could be a friend this could be a friend this could be someone from the past could be family 
Yeah, he's in his feelings. He's feeling very sensitive, very emotional. He feels like he just wants to hide. Some of you guys, he wanted you to feel like you guys had some kind of... Um, he wants you to feel like you guys had some kind of spiritual connection, like you guys had an intuitive connection, telepathic connection. You possibly have something like that with someone else. Okay, he feels like Sun in Leo. Yeah, he's spiritually attacking y'all. There's a guy here on top of the deck with a sword attacking two people's mind. Look at this. He's doing spiritual attacks over you or you and someone else. You and a partner. He's doing this over at least two people. Son and Leo. Okay. What God was just telling me. He is looking. This man is looking at it like. Like this, this is not what was supposed to happen. You were supposed to be with me. He's mad. He, he was doing something behind the scenes, some kind of magic to get you to feel like you were obsessed with him, obsession spells and stuff like that. He wanted you to feel like you were just so obsessed with him. You just had to be with him and stuff like that. You just had to have this romantic connection with him. He thought you guys were going to be happy together, have the, have fortune together. Yeah. Some of you guys, if you have money or prosperity or you're doing well you have good luck good fortune he thought you was going to be with him and you guys was going to be rich together that's what he's crying over some of you guys what i'm seeing there's there's earth here with this distance some of you guys this person lives far away they're at a, a long distance this person could have wanted to, you guys, this person could have been expecting to have a long distance relationship and then um, be together or something like that. That's what I'm getting to. He feels like someone else in your life was supposed to be left behind is what I'm hearing. He's mad because you and somebody else is happy, smiling, overjoyed. Yeah, he's watching you guys and doing magic and spiritual attacks. But then he's trying to present himself to other people like he's the opposite. There could be some people like at this person's job or something wondering like why is this person why are they quitting their job all of a sudden something like that yeah, he wanted the fortune he's a foe he's phony foe this is an enemy They're big mad. Yeah, this hit luck reversed. They're big mad. Anger issues. Emotionally charged. Impulsive. I'm not going anywhere. You are my favorite notification. Toxic masculinity. Yeah, he's a toxic masculine. But he shows, he shows people at his job or in his life the opposite. Okay, some of you guys with this you're my favorite notification some of you guys this person is watching you they could have like notifications on when you post on your social media for some of you guys this person could follow you follow you online yeah this person has some kind of like um not this is for some of you guys this person has some kind of notifications like when you post online or when your person posts online something like that
yeah, this person is sitting back behind the scenes watching you. Hanged man, page of swords. He sees you having some kind of breakthrough. Yeah, knight of cups reversed. Eight of swords reversed, eight of wands. Yeah, he's not going to be able to um, spiritually attack you anymore. He's a hypocrite. He's a knight of cups reversed. He's fake happy, jealous, emotionally unstable, always having emotional outbursts, can't control his emotions. He's a liar, could be a cheater, player, emotionally unavailable. He's a toxic masculine. Yeah, he's behind the scenes watching you, waiting for notifications for when you post or something. You guys are in the Ten of Cups, and then he's in the Wheel of Fortune right first, split the deck. Yeah, you could have walked away from this person in the Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups, Nine of Cups, Ten of Cups, he's in the Wheel of Fortune right first, while you guys are having all this happiness. Yeah, he's 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 facing jail time. I'm telling you, this man is already in spiritual jail right now for everything he's been doing to you or others, and he's about to be in literal, actual prison.